What is up guys, it's the scripting legend here, and today I am back to my how to make a game like epic mini game video series, and um, today we are going to be making it so that once you are finished um, with the game, it will show you all the people who won on top here, like where it shows intermissions, and um, we're also going to be making it so that only three people can win the game. I mean the race game, and um, so that it will give you coins as well as um wins. All right, so um, let's get into it. Actually, before we get into it, um, let me just say, uh, please remember to subscribe. Eighty percent of you guys who watch this are actually not subscribed to me, so um, I'll really appreciate it if you guys subscribe, and um, it will really help for upcoming videos. So please subscribe now. Alright, and now let's get into it. So, first thing we're gonna do is actually make it so that we can, um, only three people can win the, um, game. Uh, actually, no, we're gonna make it so that it displays all the winners on top here. So, um, what we're gonna do is insert a string value into Replicate Storage and name it to winners. And leave the value blank right now. And now what we're going to do is, um, we're going to drag both of our mini games out of server storage maps folder, and we're going to drag them into the workspace. And we're going to go to the race one first, so um, just drop that arrow down, go to win place, and um, the win script. Alright, so now we're going to make it do um, so that it adds you to the winners list. So we're going to do, um, here we'll just make a variable for that. We'll do local, um, local add to winners is equal to game direct. Right here, we'll just do local winners is equal to game dot replicate storage dot winners. Then we'll do um, do winners dot value is equal to winners dot value um, uh, dot dot quotation marks space. Um. Then we'll do dot dot plr dot um we'll actually we'll just do hit dot parent dot name all right so hit dot parent dot name um and then we'll do dot dot t uh, speech marks comma all right so um now we're just going to copy this script Copy it, and we're gonna go um into the win place in map two, so the award win, and to the script, just paste it in, and um there we go. Now let's um grab both of our maps, drag them back into the maps folder and server storage, and let's hit play. Alright, so this actually doesn't make it so that it shows you the winners yet. Just letting you guys know right now. Just want to see if um it actually adds us to the winners place here. All right. All right. Star Race Track mini game, which is good because I think that one's quicker to just win on. All right. So. Which time are we at? Four minutes, not bad. Alright, so let's get on the seat and um, let's just drive around the track and let's win. Alright, so we are in the winner's place. Look at that, worked perfectly. And um, we also have a win now. Alright, so now what we're gonna do is go, we're going to have to open up the game handler script. And um, I 
All right, so before we do anything, just inside of replicate storage, insert an int value. Int value, rename it to, um, rename it to num of winners. Whoops, rename it to num of winners, not set the value to that because it won't work. So I'll look for number of winners. Alright, so now in, um, we're going to have to go back into um, map 1, which is the racetrack map, and into um, win place, and into win script. And we're also going to have to do, um, going to have to do game.replicated storage dot num of winners dot value is equal to game dot replicated storage dot num of winners dot dot value plus one. All right, so um, now we're going to go into game handler. And um, we're going to go, all right, for this one where it says racetrack, so just scroll down to the bottom of game handler, script into here, and then we're going to do, um, to, after the clock that value equals to 2msi, we're going to do um, if game dot replicate storage dot num of winners dot value is equal to three three then all right um then game that let's just copy this copy that and paste it in here um is equal to zero and then we'll do break Um, all right, so yeah, here we go. Um, but what we're also gonna do now is all right, so now what we're gonna do is before we destroy the map, actually, right after we destroy the map, we're gonna do um, um, clock dot value is equal to um. Is equal to game dot replicate storage dot winners dot value. Then we'll do we'll wait uh, five and then we'll do clock dot value is equal to blank. All right. Um. Yeah. So now. Um, all right. Let's test this out. But for now, um, let's just make it so that it's like, um, only if one player wins because I'm the only player here. So, um, if I win, then, um, on the racetrack map, then it should stop. It should stop the game. So, let's hope it's racetrack map. Alright, so let's just wait for the countdown. You see, I had zero wins. All right. Oh, of course, the time we wanted to be um this. I mean, the other mini game. Whoa! Well, this one is very laggy. All right. So um, I, at least I have one win now. All right, but um, we're going to have to play this again and try to get it to um. I'll try to get it to choose the racetrack minigame, so let's see. Alright, so it's just not choosing that one, so we're gonna have to see that in a little, like, hopefully. We'll just leave it at one for now anyways. Um, so now let's just make it, um, 
let's make it so that it gives you points. So go into the win script in um, map one, and so in the win place, the win script. So we're gonna do. Um, I guess we'll give them like 20 coins. So we'll do plr plr dot meter stats dot coins dot value is equal to plr dot meter stats dot coins dot value plus plus 20. All right. Now we can just copy this line and um, go into map 2, the award win, in the script, and then just paste that in here. And now let's hit play. Wait for the intermission. Selecting a mini game. The mini game has been selected. The mini game is traffic in trouble. Loading mini game. All right, so I have zero wins. I'm level one, and I have zero coins. Okay, let's um, let's try that again. So let's play. Wait for the intermission to go down. Alright, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Select a minigame. Minigame has been selected. The minigame is trapped in trouble. Loading minigame. Let's wait for this card to pass. It's gonna go here. Dang it, the car actually got me that time. Um, so, yeah, let me um, just speed this up until I'm about to win. Alright guys, instead of speeding it up, I have a better idea. Um, let's drag map one out of the um, maps folder and into the workspace. And let's just click play here. Play here. And um, now let's, we have zero wins, zero coins. And now we have one win and 20 coins. So that part works. Um, how much time are we at? 14 minutes, not bad at all. It's, all right. Um, so now what we're going to try to do is we are going to try and, um, try and actually see if what we did before works. Like if, um, uh, if it will display the winners at the end. Let's just give this one more try to try to pick the racetrack mini game. Cause it's been picking traffic and trouble a lot. Okay. Alright, so it's not picking it. So what we're going to do is we're just going to drag map 2 back into the workspace and we are going to duplicate on map 1 and rename it to map 2. So now it's going to have to um, pick racetrack. Alright, so this is just for testing. You don't want to actually like do this, so you guys don't have to do this. Just want to um, make sure it works. What we did before. All right. You 
Demon's Race track. Because that's the only thing it could be. Alright, so we got the tunnel going. Sit in our seat, drive the car around the track. Do um like a semi donut, I guess. That kind of was. And um um become a better driver on Roblox. Alright, so um Alright, so we win. Alright. Um I'm the only winner. So that's why it says come. Alright, so um um to make it so that it doesn't say um comma, let's um into map one. Just go into the win place, the win script, and we'll do um just do a little if right here, we'll do if um game that we could normal win, so let's just copy that. If is um not equal is not equal to um zero then uh oh, alright here so for we're gonna do um we're gonna do if game that storage that num of wins that value is equal to two then and then we'll just drop a line here we'll make this an end um and we'll just uh we'll just delete this here and then we'll copy this line copy that um now add an else an else and paste the line in and then do the with do with the comma um here we'll do greater than or equal to two then all right so now um all right so that should be good now now let's go into the game handler script if you did this then just change this back to three all right all right so um there we go uh, let's um just delete the false map 2 and um drag map real map 2 back into the maps folder and um all right guys well i think that's gonna be it for today's video if you enjoyed and this helped you out please remember to leave a like and subscribe and i'll see you in the next video bye wait also remember to join my um fan group in the dis the link to the group is in the description um I really appreciate if you join, show your support, and also you can ask me any questions. And um, yeah, please remember to leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!